hey guys welcome to my channel so in this video i'm going to show you something really cool which is going to blow your mind so let me open youtube and let me try to go live so in order to go live you have to use tools like obs and stuff but you can also use some really minimal tools like ffmpeg which is a cli tool and i'm going to show you why using ffmpeg can be a good option because you can do really creative stuff okay so this is like a stream key which you get by youtube and this is like the stream url and let me open my terminal here so the video which i'm going to you know just send live is this video now you might wonder like wait you are sending a video live well yes you can do it okay so i don't know like how to do this with obs but you know this is the video first of all so as you can see it's a music video basically so i want to send this video live now imagine like if you are running some channel where you will run music all day well uh, you can use this method to just send music all day or anything okay so this this is like really awesome so i will i will explain you some really cool stuff but first let's just try to live stream some video uh, with a ba very basic thing okay so let's just copy the link so the program is ffmpeg and give the input so input is basically tag here right and let's just change the format to flv so hyphen f is for f um, you know format and basically the basic task of ffmpeg is the conversion of format so you can convert mkv to flv or mp4 to mkv anything okay so after that just give the link of the output and after that this is not the whole link so you also have to copy the stream key and then just give the stream key i'm going to reset the stream key so there is no benefit if you try to you know to live stream something so let's just press enter and just wait and as you can see here so it's about to happen all right so we are live okay this is so easy okay so let's just copy the link and there is some gl glitch in youtube so you can't see live here but if i just open the link here on the channel so as you can see the video is live and it's running so as soon as like when the you know video get finished uh, this will get close so this is pretty cool by the way i just loved this when i realized like you can just go live stream like this okay so let me close the song i don't want copyright or something so this is really cool but this is very basic okay i mean there must be something more which we can do so yeah we can do actually we can change the you know bit rate we can change the resolution we can do all the things which ffmpeg can do but here's one more example which i want to show you all right so you can't just live stream the video so the best part about ffmpeg is suppose if there is some live stream already running so let's just look at some here you can see that we got some live cams here so what i'm going to do now is i'm just going to copy the link and open my terminal so if we use youtube dl with the option i hyphen f best for best resolution and then get url and paste the link and press enter so this is just going to give us the link of the video so this is the link where we can just if, if we put this in mpv this is just going to you know we can watch the live stream all right so this is cool but i just want to make variable of it pretty quickly and then use ffmpeg hyphen i so this is the cool part about ffmpeg the input can be anything all right it can be download link it can be you know any stream or anything basically not anything it should be a video file but in any format it doesn't have to be just file so for example your webcam input can just go directly into ffmpeg okay so this is the cool part and after that just change the format to flv again and again the rtmp link so let's just go to live stream and this live stream all right so we don't we we want to do a new live stream so dismiss it so youtube is doing doing some shit just ignore it so let's just copy the uh, stream link and again copy the stream key and just paste it here and after that just clear the screen press enter and this is literally mind-blowing okay so just get the link of our live stream copy it and uh, it's about to happen all right it's, it's taking time but it's about to happen so as you can see we are live and let's just paste the link and watch what is going live so just wait a second it should it should work okay let's just all right look at this we stole the stream okay 
now this stream is on my channel okay this is so cool i mean you can literally like it's so easy first of all all you have to do is just you can't do this with obs or maybe you can but i don't know like how okay it's like you're not you you can be creative you're not slave of some gui or something like that so, okay so let's just close this and let's let me just you know explain you some things and there is some more like polishing stuff which you might need so for example uh first and understand like how ffmpeg work all right so open the man page and uh, let's just watch it so the idea is basically you provide some input file which can be anything it can be your webcam or it can be like any kind of uh, download link or something like that because ffmpeg is can just fetch the video from the download link and after that ffmpeg is just decode the packets all right so you get some encoded uh, data packets by this process of demixer or whatever and ffmpeg is just going to decode the packet and you get the frames all right so you just get raw frames and you can do filtering you can just resize the frame you can do whatever you want and after that ffmpeg is just going to encode the frames again in in a different kind of encoder so if you provide some new encoder like lib x265 it's going, just going to change the you know because there is re-encoding all right so this is point which i'm trying to make and after that there is another process muxer and then you can just push the output anywhere okay you can literally push it to rtmp stream you can you know push it to anywhere all right you can push it into a file or something so you need to understand this so you can understand the options and everything so so here's this script stream.sh which i have and you guys can use this for more polished way to live stream okay so the idea is pretty simple you give the input it can be any file it can be webcam it can be anything and again you are going to change the codecs you're going to just tell what codec now you want because there is encoding which is happening so you can just tell what encoder you want and you can give the you know pixel format which can be like 420p or 720p preset is basically like how fast you want things to happen but if you go very fast well in that uh, case you have to you know you get low quality okay so after that it's fps i don't understand what hyphen g is just tell me in the comments this is just bitrate of video you can just tell the bitrate this is audio codec again since you're recording you can also tell the audio codec this is ar which is basically okay what is this i don't know it's like audio something it's like audio rate okay after that this is just threads this is just q scale you can read about q scale in the man page and uh, i read it i forget it and this is really really bad tutorial but i am just showing you stuff so this is like a bit rate of audio and again the buffer size like how much buffer you need of video at one point and after that it's just new format flv and this is just youtube url and key which is here all right so uh, why i have this source here i don't know just just don't use this IV or something okay so this is it and uh, i hope you like this video if you like then just go and when i popped off then your girl gave me just